And what specific advice would you give to people that have chosen to go to India, to Jaipur, to the orphanage that you went to volunteer at? What, based on your experience, what specific information and sort of advice would you give them? Um, so the, um, I think I would give them is to like take in as much knowledge as possible that you can take, understand the culture more, understand the way of living and also get to know the children as well because they all have different stories and um, some are very very funny as well and they're very very nice so like understand a bit about their culture and I think that's that's something that you for me is I've taken with me and I've taken back and that will definitely impact you. Um, what would so. you suggest, um, what any additional information would you give to people like would you say to people um, like, is there any specific, like, you've obviously documented a lot of mm -hmm. your trip, like, a good camera, like, oh, what sort okay. of stuff, like, additional things would you say that has to make this trip? You want to remember it, right? So I think, I think the best way to remember it is definitely doing, like, photography out there, um, I think, because if you have pictures and um, you take pictures of your whole journey, then you can make, like, a photo album or you can make something that just brings the experience and it makes it so much more fruitful as well. And I think that's definitely, and if you have a camera, maybe do some filming as well, because I think, like, especially, not lots of these things are very overlooked as well. So if you capture every moment and every happy moment with the children, then it will kind of just not only make your journey um, very fruitful, but it will actually make the whole experience. And then you, then people can realise and see what positive, what positive stuff is going on as well.